perfectly uh Zozo just had her bath and her hair is all wet so I thought we'd do a mommy and me wash and well not wash and go but wash routine instead of just me so basically it's kind of like the same concept of her newborn wash routine if you guys have not seen that I will link it below so her hair is soaking wet and sometimes she's a little fussy so I have to let it dry let her play and do her thing and then re-wet it and the back is kind of dry, so that's what I'm going to do today, is just re-wet the little back part. She still has <laughs> that bald spot, y'all. Yeah. She still has it. So, I soak her hair with the water. And then, I take this Everything Butter by Taylor Beauty. And all I do is put this product on her scalp. Can I see you so I can put it on your scalp, baby? Here, you can hold it open. So I just part in sections and just rub it on her scalp. Oh no, I lost it. Oh no. Don't eat it. Don't eat it. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. Eat it. Don't eat it. That's what. Once the product's on her scalp, stop eating it. I just massage her head like this until it is all massaged. Then I take a little bit. Massage it in my hands and just massage it on her hair. And that's it for these products. And after I put the shea butter on there and it's all massaged in her hair and she's looking like a wild child, I go in with the Grow Thick Oil. This thing was full and I only have like what's left. Are you serious? You got shea butter on your mouth, on your nose? So anyway, I just take this and put it on my hands and put it on her hair. After the oil is all rubbed into this poor baby's head, I just take the Demon brush and kind of just brush through it, especially in the back because she has thick hair in the back. And then in the front, I just finger detangle it or brush through it, whichever I choose. So when brushing through her hair, I make sure that I hold towards the end, start brushing there first, and then I brush towards the root of her hair, just so I'm not pulling and she's not getting fussy or it's not hurting her at all. That's pretty much it. That's literally all we do. And she's good to go. And I usually do this once or twice a week. Most of the time, she only gets her hair shampooed once. So then the other time throughout the week, all I do is spray it with water and either add the shea butter or the oil. I usually don't do both. But her hair stays pretty moisturized for a few days. So that's what I like about these products. And I'd like to keep it simple and quick because she has no patience with me. She don't want to sit here forever, which I understand. Yeah, tell them, you don't want to sit here. You don't want me to be doing your hair all day? I know. Tell them. Oh, I'm going to show you guys the back too so you can see. You don't want me to show them? Because as she's gotten older, <laughs> I'm sorry. The spot has just gotten bigger. But it's growing in. You can, you'll be able to see it too. So. Okay, we got to turn around. Zozo, do you remember the first time we did this video, baby? Wait, here you go. Huh, do you remember? So, this is what the back looks like updated. You can see little spots are growing in. But you know, it's because she rubs her head on stuff. And So, Zozo is done with this hair routine and she's done with me. So, I gotta go let her play. Say bye bye, Zozo. Say bye bye. Say bye bye. Say bye bye, Zozo. Say bye bye. Bye bye. You gotta push your arm up. So yes. Yeah. Yeah. Say bye bye. Bye. Okay, bye. bye. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. Ha 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 
Yay!